So this little video, I'm going to show y'all how my water-fed wagtail is. The one that you just use a mop, a separate mop, and then the separate water-fed wagtail. This will just be probably more or less for route work, outside, commercial. It's a commercial application. If you wanted to add a pad, you could, but this particular one is different. I didn't want to, because the, the way I did it, it, it just has to work by itself unless you have a mop over the top. But then you'll be having it flip back. So the only way you can use it like a regular squeegee is to have it underneath. So I decided to leave it off just to have a different application. So let's jump into it. Thank you. 
Fed Wagtail did a good job. Oh my. Oh my. This came out fabulous. Marvelous, darling. Simply marvelous. Even the soft scrub residue, sometimes if I'm using soft scrub, I really have to rinse it thoroughly because sometimes the residue will bleed back onto the window. But uh, that soft scrub actually gets all the dirt off even without a brush because it just breaks down dirt and grease. And uh, when you rinse it, but the only problem with that is you can't add too much or you'll be rinsing forever. You got to add just enough because you don't need a whole lot of stuff, not a whole lot. Of a uh, soft scrub because it's abrasive, but man, these came out fabulous. I am thoroughly impressed, Marcus. You have done it again. Well, there's some drip spots right there. I can use my finger and buff that out, but you know what? Overall, that's probably because that was actually the first one I did. And I didn't rinse it. I, w I went a little too fast, I think. Or I don't know. But needless to say, y'all saw the proof is in the pudding. You know? We got some that, that needs to be finished drying. But the rest of the windows dried. And that's because I squeegeed it. The rinse bar is underneath the rubber. So a lot of it got squeegeed. But that's the... The ones that you saw is like butcher marks from the water. I don't know if I would actually call them butcher marks. But like I said, you don't have to really have too much technique involved. You're squeegeeing that dirt soft scrub down. And the rinse bar is actually uh, helping you while you're squeegeeing. Just in case you may have missed some things. Uh, you're pretty much squeegee in pure water at that point. But uh, y'all get the general idea. The idea is that it dries faster when you're in a wooded area and you have a lot of gnats flying around. And, um, you know, you got dust, you got 
stuff from the trees. And if the landscapers are out, it's just less chance to have the window saturated because that dust is going to stick to that wet window that you just water fed. It'll do a lot less if you have a tool like that. But y'all get the idea, man. Y'all get the idea. I'm telling you, man, use your noggin. You you can see that that uh the advantages of it. And maybe some of you can see the disadvantages. But there you have it. Masters at Wagtail in the house. And another job done. I'm out of here. Macafraca. <laughs>